Hey, what's up? Wade McNeil hanging out at Suspect Video, talking about some movies. Ricky O, the story of Ricky. A boy with a special power, born with the strength of 20 men. He was sent to a correctional facility where the laws of survival take precedence over the laws of man. Only the strongest will come out alive. The story of Ricky. Set in the distant future past of 2001, where all prisons have been privatized, our hero Ricky finds himself locked up after murdering the evil crime boss that killed his girlfriend. In China, the rating system goes up to category three. And this is the first movie ever to be put in that category that isn't a porno. It's a stunning accomplishment. <laughs> like the invention of penicillin. The best kill in this movie is during a knife fight, guy pulls out his own guts, tries to strangle Ricky with them. Honorable mention, guy getting his head crushed. Dude's bare hands. During the last fight sequence, there was actually so much fake blood, the actor that played Ricky was stained completely red and they couldn't remove it. So they actually had to stall production on this movie for three days. So this film is based off a popular Japanese manga comic. And in that weird world of schoolgirls, sexy tentacles and other bizarre things, maybe this adds up. But on the big screen, not so much. I give Ricky O four short rounds from Indiana Jones out of five. I think you pair this movie with a night out in Shibuya at Lexington Queen. And the lights keep getting dimmer and you're getting drunker and it gets later and they keep getting dimmer. And around four o'clock you're thinking, am I in complete darkness here and surrounded by people in this bar is still open? Am I at a gangbang? If you like gangbangs, check out Ricky O. On the Roger Corman B-movie scale, boobs, like zero. Blood, so much blood. Five out of five, perfect score. Bizarre? It's pretty bizarre. One. <laughs> That's it, you gotta see this movie. Tell me what you think in the comments section. See you next week.